So as a store owner, if you have this positive, welcoming community that people know to look for new players, to welcome them into the circle, what you'll end up seeing is your community is going to grow over time. People are going to have a great time. They're going to want to bring their friends in because they know they'll be welcomed. They'll talk about their experience. They'll want to come back. And those are the things that build a healthy store community. It's always a good reminder to realize that our community is extremely wide and we want to keep it growing. Creating personal relationships with your customer base is essential to having a great store environment. Every single person is bringing a different perspective that helps to grow us as a whole. That prevailing attitude in your community is only going to help bring more people into your store. The first thing on the code of conduct was be welcoming. So when somebody would walk into my store, I would say hi. A lot of my regulars would say hi even if they never knew them before. The most successful stores that I've seen have had large learn to play events where uh, players who are new to the scene will come and you know experience the brand for the first time, experience a tournament setting for the first time. Uh, casual events where there's not much on the line where people just get to come and spend time and maybe it's a pizza party, uh, maybe it's an off night where instead of Friday night it's Thursday night, or bring a friend day. Games are competitive. There's a winner at the outcome of every duel. One way that I've seen some stores to alleviate that is to spread out the prize pool so that more players receive a prize. Things of this nature don't have to have high monetary value. Playmats, stickers, buttons, a participation prize that more customers can enjoy really makes everyone feel good about the experience about being in your store. The other key is uh, enthusiastic promotion. So if you want to get a bunch of people into your Friday Night Magics, talk about it like it is the most amazing thing ever and then deliver on it. That event needs to be amazing, and then they'll come back to do it again.